Hey girls, welcome back to uh, the live version of Internet Connectivity in Beulah, Michigan. Um, I will finish up this card and we've got one more. Um, we are back with uh, avocado ink smeared on the lid. We're going to use our clear shimmer brush to pick it up. And then all we're going to do is color behind this. You can add as much or as little as you want. Look how fun that is. Super, super easy. Just make sure that you use the intense black as your choice to stamp it originally because this one is um, solvent based, not dye based. So it won't smear when you color on top of it. Good. Then I'm just going to push them out just to clear off the end of my brush until it's clear again and we're good. Super fun, super easy. Okay, we've got one more. This is our Bloom with Grace. And the reason I did this one, couple, couple thoughts, is that it uses, oops, this brand new die. I don't know what shape to call this, but it's cute. And I like that it's more square, so you can get a, a larger sentiment on top of it. So this is Your Kindness Means So Much. And then this one, see the stitched edge? Can you see that on camera? That is this one. And it is, see if I can line it up for you, that edge. Fun? Super easy. It's, it's hard to imagine what these are gonna look like when they're cut out. So that's what I wanted to show you. Um, you can use these on for a scrapbook layout as well. You would just continue the cut on right through the, the length of your paper. Just move it. So here is the brand new wood grain. If you have not gotten your hands on this, this is a must have. And it goes beautifully with the, well really it goes beautifully with anything. But the bloom paper especially has a brown in it. Here is our font. Chevrons, if they are a pain for you. Here's your time saver. Eyeball the middle. Cut up to the where you want the peak to be. And then go point to center. And then I'm right-handed, so I flip it over and go point to center again. They're not perfect, but they're darn close. Easy, easy way if you have a hard time when you get crooked, crooked chevrons. This is the, the first paper for me that Espresso has made its debut and I really like it. Square, our sentiment across the middle. I tried to accelerate this a little bit so that you don't have to watch me do all the details. But this is espresso ink to go with the cardstock. Now, here is our little saying in avocado. If you don't have avocado, honestly, it's very, very close to um, fern or even. It's somewhere in between, remember Garden Green? Somewhere a step up from that. And what's been, this is another opportunity for you to paper piece. Just like when we have maybe a little animal and we, we cut out, remember, in colored paper and then we cut it out, put it on top. You can do that with sentiments. And that's what we're gonna do here. So all I did is re-stamp that in the avocado and then look, we can change the color. here I think I lost my heart so I'm gonna go back and show you this one again isn't that sweet super super simple these in particular are absolutely must-have um, this is a nice square shape for you because um, I know you have lots of sentiments we all do in different sizes so super easy and then all of you uh, VIPs that signed up yesterday's founding member, you have an opportunity to get every single stamp of the month for free, every single month. 
So no longer paying $5 unless you want a second or third one, but for that first set, you get it for free. So don't miss out getting yours. This is a really cute one. And it has so many good words, so many in a really cute little size. I thought missing you was appropriate as well. Okay, have fun. Holly's up next. We'll talk to you guys soon.